Okay, my Kayla crew, today is a Transcend day. Now, you guys know that Transcend is one of my favorite clothing boxes. I think I say that in pretty much every Transcend unboxing that I do. The prices are a little bit higher. Well, they can be a lot higher sometimes, but the quality is there in my opinion. So, you know, you get what you pay for. Now, I did put a lot of things on my wish list. With Transcend, you can put things on a wish list on Ever Eve's website because Transcend boxes come from the store Ever Eve and I filled my wish list with a ton of new pieces. My stylist, Haley, she's awesome. She wrote me a note and she said, unfortunately, she couldn't find a lot of pieces to add to my wish list, but she did find a few, so let's jump in and see what Haley sent me this time. Okay, let's start with this first sweater, which is by the brand DRA. I've never tried anything by that brand before. It's new to me, but the quality feels really nice. This is the Lily Ruffle Pullover in gold and yellow. I'm wearing a size extra large, and my price is $78.40. I say my price because somebody used my link, so if it was you, thank you so much. That means I get 20% off of anything in this box that I decide to keep. It helps out a lot, and I hope that you enjoyed your first Transcend box as well. I'm telling yeah, the quality is there. Be prepared to pay higher prices, but you're going to get some good quality pieces. And I love that they send you suggested outfit pairings. So this first outfit does have three pieces. So let me continue talking about the pullover and then we'll talk about the rest of the outfit. So the fabric is 53% viscose, 31% polyester, and 16% nylon. You can machine wash this in cold water on a gentle cycle, and it was made in China. I love the color of this sweater. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I think that the ruffles are too much for me because of my shape. I just think it's too frilly, and they're just, I don't know. But I love the sweater otherwise. It has a rounded neckline, and it's ribbed. The neckline comes way further from my face than a normal like round and neckline which is nice and it has the cable knit in the front can you see that yeah I just don't care for the ruffles kind of looks like I have some wings <laughs> a little bit right I don't know it's just it's not for me but I think it will look cute on the right person I just think it's too bulky up top for me I don't know just not doesn't hit me in the right spot and I have a larger chest, so I think it just kind of accentuates it too. I don't know. What do you think? But I love the color. I love wearing yellows and mustard yellows in the fall. Um, I'll come close so you could see it's got the ribbing around the wrist area. I really like the color of this sweater a lot. So the cable knit goes all the way down the front. Let me show you the back of it. So yeah, this is going to be a no because of the ruffles. I would like to see this sweater without the ruffles. I think it would be a cute sweater and it feels like a really nice quality piece too, which is a plus. It kind of has a little bit of a balloon sleeve. Can you see how it kind of creates that? So yeah, I really wish it didn't have these ruffles because I think it would be cute. <laughs> but anyway, since it does, we can't take them off. It's going to be a no. And let's talk about the jeans. I'm going to turn the camera down. She sent me a blouse, but I think the blouse would look nice with outfit number two as well. So I'm, what I'm going to do is we'll talk about the jeans now. Then I'll put the blouse on with the jeans because she did send them with outfit number one. And then I'll put the pants from outfit number two. I'm talking too much. Let me just do it so you can see what I'm talking about. Okay, so let's talk about the jeans. These are by Cut From The Cloth. They're calling these the Rosa High Rise Ankle Straight in the shade Dance. I'm wearing a size 16 and my price is $79.20. I believe these were on my wish list. They're made of a 99% cotton and 1% spandex made in China and you can machine wash these in cold water. I think these are kind of flattering on. I've got to dig in these jeans. What do you think? I know for fall, I typically reach for darker wash denim, but I really like this wash. They do have a button fly. Um, they do have their classic five pocket style. And I did throw on some booties. You guys have seen these many, many times. These are like my go-to booties. These are by Steve Madden. I just threw them on because they were a little bit long, but with booties, they're great length. I don't think they have any distressing. Um, I looked in the mirror and then you know, obviously when I pulled them out of the box, I didn't see any distressing. Um, I really like them. So these would be good for work too on casual Fridays. What do you think about them? I think they're fun. Let me show you the back of them. I like them and I don't have many pairs of straight denim, straight cut denim. You guys know I have a ton of skinnies. And so I think this is a good pair to add to my wardrobe. What do you think about them? 
I like them. I do like it with the sweater, but again, I'm not going to keep this sweater because I don't like the way the sweater looks on me, but I think as, like color wise, it looks good. So what do you think? I think they may end up being keepers. All right, I'll be right back and I'm gonna show you the blouse. All right, let's talk about the blouse. This is by the brand Ever Eve. They're calling this the Brita Border Print Blouse in Gold. I'm wearing a size extra large and my price is $70.40. The fabric is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. This was made in the USA of imported fabrics and you can machine wash this in cold water. Doesn't this blouse just scream fall? I love the colors and I love the pattern. When I put this on, I'm like, this would be a pretty Thanksgiving blouse. I know, I'm thinking ahead today. What's today? Sunday the 9th, but I was watching QVZ this morning and whoever, who was the host? I don't remember, but he was like, there's only 11 Sundays until Christmas. So the holidays are gonna be here before we know it. Scary, right? Time is just flying by. So anyway, I thought this would be perfect for Thanksgiving with the burgundy pants, as long as they fit and look right, that I'm gonna show you next. But yeah, I thought it was a really pretty blouse. It is a little bit snug in the bust area. That's the only thing. I tend to have that problem with polyester blouses because I have a bigger bust area. Um, but anyway, let's talk about the blouse. It's got a split V neck. It came with these ties. You guys know I prefer an open neckline, but just so you could see how it looks, I will show you. Hang on, come on, Kayla. So you can wear it tied if you wanted to for a little bit more modesty and kind of create a little keyhole. It's a little bit low cut, but not too, too low. Um, and then it does have, I think it, yeah. No, it doesn't. I thought I had a drop shoulder. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Let me not tell you that. It does have elastic around the sleeves. Again, not tight to my wrist. Look at the pretty pattern. So this is what they're calling the border print. Love that. And then the print throughout is this pretty paisley with the burgundies against the mustard. Isn't it gorgeous? I just think it screams fall. I love this blouse. What do you think about it? Cute, right? Fits well otherwise. Just the bust area is a little snug. Let me show you the back. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Perfect for fall for work. All right, oh, let me show you. This is outfit number one with the jeans. I'll back up so you can see the whole thing. Can you see the whole thing? What's wrong with my camera angle today? <laughs> but here's the whole outfit. I think I need to adjust it a little bit before the next, oh, you know what it is? I'm wearing heels, so I adjust it for my normal height and I have heeled, I have my heeled booties on, so that's what it is. Okay, let me grab those pants. I think we'll go with those first and then we'll go with the tops for outfit number two. I'll be right back. Okay, so let's talk about these pants. These are by Cut From The Cloth. These are the Code and Reese Utility Pant in Bordeaux. I'm wearing a size 16 and my price is $79.20. The fabric is 59% modal, 39% polyester, and 2% lycra. You can machine wash these in cold water separately, inside out, and they were made in China. I was so hopeful for these to work out. I thought they were so fun. You know when you go to the store and you see something on the rack and you get so excited about it, and then you go in the fitting room and you try it on and you're like, oh, that doesn't look as good as I was hoping. That's the feeling I'm having with these pants. I just don't think they're flattering on me. I love the color and I love the style. I think they're so fun for fall. And don't they look really pretty with this blouse? It kind of pulls out the burgundy. But again, I just don't think they're flattering on me. I looked in the mirror and I, you know, I'm looking in the viewfinder. I just don't know. I don't think they're they're a good look for me. I'm the right person. I think they'd be so cute, but yeah, I don't know. They do have pockets at the front and I'm, the, I'm going to um, turn to the side and then I'll zoom in at the ankle on each side. They do have a zipper. So I think that's a cute look. Yeah, I just don't know about the look on me. Let me show you the back of them. They have pockets in the back too. I love the coated style. I'm going to come. Can you see? Love the color. I just, I don't think they look right on me. I don't know. I'm going to watch back and see. So, all right, let's move on to the next piece. I'm going to put on the two tops that came with outfit number two. We're going to get a little bit backwards with outfit number two, and I'll be right back. Okay, so next up is this white tee. This is by the brand Ever Eve. This is the Soren Snap Cuff Tee in white. I'm wearing a size extra large and the price is, or my price is $46.40. 
the fabric, 68% polyester, 27% rayon, and 5% spandex, made in China, and you can machine wash this in cold water. It's pretty see-through. I know I have a white bra on. I probably should have switched to a nude bra, but I got some new bras, and I was excited to wear them. I say new, but they're the same brand. I have favorite bras by Bali, so if you're interested, I'll link them below. I swear by them. I've gotten them on Amazon. These came from Kohl's because I had some Kohl's cash and coupons. So anyway, I love them, and I want to wear my new ones, so <laughs> we're just going to roll with it, but I think it would still be uh, sheer even with my nude bra underneath. You know, I'm this year, we've gotten a lot of see-through sheer white tops. They don't seem to be making white tops like t-shirts super thick anymore. They always seem to be a little bit sheer. When I went on my shopping trip with Carolyn from Carolyn and Her Clothes, I will link Carolyn's channel below. We noticed the same thing. And this was back in, I think we went in April or May. So anyway, it's a long sleeve t-shirt. It's got the stitching here, like that V stitching. Um, you can see it on the shoulder area. And then here's this, whoops, where'd it go? The snaps. I'll show you on this arm. It's easier. There you go. Are these functioning? Yes, they are. You can unsnap one or two or three or four or five, as many as you'd like or as few as you'd like. So I do like that. But yeah, I don't know. They're a little bit sheer. So I'm going to send this one back. Let me show you the back of it. You know, I can tell that the quality with this is definitely there too. So like I said, the quality with the, the Ever Eve clothing, the Transcend, you know, what comes in your boxes is there. But this one, I just don't really need this one either. Okay, I do, you know what though? I do like white um, V-necks long sleeves. So if it was maybe a V-neck, I'd consider keeping it. But yep, don't need this one. You know what? I did receive, I'm <laughs> getting way off topic. But I think last year, the year before, I received a top like this. It, it was in a camo print that has the snaps here. I just wore it yesterday and I'm like, oh, I love that tee. So if this comes in a print, maybe I'd consider getting it in a print. All right, now I'm going to throw on the jacket. I'll be right back. All right, let's talk about the last piece with outfit number two. It's actually the last piece in the box. This box, I only received six pieces. I normally receive more in my Transcend boxes. I went back to my note. All this time, I thought it was Haley that styled my box. This time, it was, and I have a new stylist, and I can't read her name. They hand write their names on the front of your note, and I, I don't know. I can't read what it is, so we do have a new stylist, so let's see what she put together for outfit number two with this jacket, or we know what she put together. Let's talk about the jacket. I'm just starting to film. I better have another cup of coffee because if I'm struggling with my words in this video and it's only the first one, I've got like three or four more boxes to film today, so I may need a coffee break. Okay, so this jacket is by Sanctuary. This is the Cassidy jacket in sandstone. I'm wearing a size extra large and my price is $127.20. The fabric is 57% lyocell. 37% polyester, 4% rayon, and 2% spandex. You can machine wash this in cold water, and it was made in China. You know, I'm kind of digging this jacket. I wasn't a jacket girl until this fall. I've been reaching for my moto jackets. I've been reaching for my denim jackets a lot more so than my vests. Usually I'm a vest girl, and this girl has been reaching for jackets right now. So yeah, I'm digging them. You know what it is? It's been really cool in the morning, and then by midday, I'm sweating, and you just need a lot of layers, and then when I leave work, it's starting to get chilly again, so the jackets are really working in my favor right now. So anyway, I know Vest can do the same thing, but I'm just loving the look of jackets. So this one, I kind of like it. What do you think? Um, let's talk through it. So it is a button-down jacket. I'll show you how it looks buttoned, but I usually wear my jackets opened. So yeah, I like the look of it open. And then the sleeves, it does have a drop shoulder. It does have a button on the sleeve. Does it look too bulky on me? That's my only concern if it looks too bulky. Sometimes the sleeves, the sleeves might look a little bit bulky, but I don't know. Oops, I just hit the box. <laughs> I definitely need a coffee break, huh? <laughs> Get it together, Kayla. It does have pockets here, the flat pockets. They don't have any closure, but they do have the flat pockets and they are functional. So you can put your phone in there. So that's nice. Um, let's see how it looks buttoned. I probably wouldn't button it all the way, but maybe just like the bottom two or three. Let's see, how does that look? No, I like it opened. I don't like it closed. Mm -mm. Unless it looks better all the way buttoned. Mm. No, it totally looks better 
on me unbuttoned. Maybe if I just did like the bottom. Nope. <laughs> totally looks better opened, I think. What do you think about it? Let me show you the back of it. It's a shorter jacket, like a craft jacket. I don't know. I'm going to have to think about this one. I'll watch back and see. All right, that was it. I only had two outfits, six pieces, so I'll meet you and we'll do a quick recap. All right, so what'd you think about this box? There were some fun styles in this box to try on. I was so bummed about those coated pants. I'm gonna watch back. I'm gonna try them out again. You know, I really wanna love them, but if they don't work out, I should just leave it alone and move on and try to find a different piece, right? Instead of convincing myself to love them, unless I watch back and I'm like, ooh, those really did look good on you, Kayla, because sometimes that happens. Sometimes I watch back and I'm like, what were you thinking? That looks great on you. And sometimes I watch back and I think, what were you thinking? That doesn't look good on you, Kayla. And it's a piece that I'm excited about. So, I mean, let's see what I think about those coated pants. So for this box, I'm going to keep the jeans. And I think I'm gonna send the rest of the box back unless I watch back and love the coated pants. I loved that blouse, but because it was a little bit snug in the bust area, I'm leaning towards sending it back. If it fit perfectly in the bust area, I would keep it in a heartbeat. I think it's a gorgeous blouse and perfect for fall, but I think I'm gonna send it back. You guys let me know what you think. Thanks so much for watching and for spending some time with me today. I really appreciate it. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I'll see you all really soon for another video. Before you go, make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on my future videos. And I'll see you all really soon for some more clothing and fashion.